Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Arizona Sheriff, I have a plan that'll stop the undocumented migrant flood forever. Arizona Sheriff Joe Arpaio has a backbone made out of titanium. I have been a fan of his for many years ever since I lived in Goodyear, Arizona when 9/11 happened. He's an honest man who believes in following the rule of law and he won't stand for coddling those who are in his jail. He's getting up there now and the way he was treated in the end by leftists is just shameful. And he's not done yet. He's got a few plans left in him and it is not a surprise they involve stopping illegal immigration. He's a strong supporter of President Trump and I'm sure those plans will make their way to his desk. Bluntness and honesty are two attributes that Joe Arpaio is known and loved for. He has a solution to stop illegal immigration in its tracks and the left will hate it. Which means the rest of us will love it. Arpaio was sheriff for many years and policing the Arizona border is no small feat. There are many portions of it that are very inhospitable to life in general and the cartels are all over it. Especially where they can slip in through national park borders. Joe loves Arizona and would do anything to protect his state. He's been accused of racially profiling innocent Hispanic people, which isn't true. He was targeted by Obama and his minions for upholding immigration law and not allowing open borders. Mistakes have been made and when Arpaio would find out that someone was wrongfully arrested, within hours they were set free. The witch hunt against Arpaio almost succeeded, but not quite and President Trump pardoned him. Since then, Arpaio is once again running for office, this time he wants to take Reno Jeff Flake's seat. That would be fantastic. During a recent interview with Breitbart, Arpaio shared his plan to stop the undocumented migrant flood forever. From Breitbart Unveiling part of his policy agenda Arpaio explained his proposal to deploy U.S. troops inside Mexico. My idea, which is maybe out of the box. Since we have agents that are government employees working with foreigners, why don't we use another government agency that happens to be the U.S. Army and send them across the border to work with the foreign authorities, the Federales and the Mexican Army? We have been doing it anyway with other types of government employees so who is going to argue with this? Because something has to be done before the drugs come over the border. Stop it before it gets to the border. That is how you solve the problem. That would work if Mexico is amenable to it. But with a brand new socialist at the helm, I wouldn't hold my breath. Sheriff Joe also called on Trump to withhold aid from Mexico if they refuse to allow our military in. That is an excellent idea. We send approximately $51.5 million in foreign aid every year to Mexico and freezing that would really smart. They have been behaving as enemy combatants, deliberately sending illegal immigrants into our country to swing the voter base and to take back land Mexico says is rightfully theirs. It's not and that is an act of war. All of this has to change and fast. Mexico doesn't allow illegal immigrants into their country. They are deported, or more likely thrown into a pit of a prison to DE. They are even considering building a wall with Central America to keep Guatemalans, Salvadorians and others from crime-ridden countries out of Mexico. But they have no qualms about invading America because without secure borders, you aren't a sovereign entity. When Mexico starts acting like an ally and unlike a wannabe conquering force, then we'll treat them like one. Until then, withhold their aid and slap sanctions on them as we do other enemy states. Just my two cents worth on the subject. They let drug cartels and gangs run rampant and KL people. Violence should be met with force in this situation. America has a right to protect her borders and her citizens. I agree with Arpaio that instead of stationing troops in countries who are not paying their fair share to NATO, such as Germany, we could send them to Mexico, or at the very least, station them on our borders to protect our country. After all, Germany and other European countries don't want us there anymore anyway. Arpaio said, we use the military everywhere else in the world, don't we? Okay. Why can't we do it with our neighbors? Forever now, I have said we not only need a wall, we need barbed wire and high tech on it as well. We also need troops, drones and ice patrolling our borders and that wall. Take a page from Israel and stop this insanity. If Arpaio wins, he wants his office on the border. If you want to see me you will have to come down to the border. He's a man that wants to be in the thick of it and always has. Joe Arpaio is still America's sheriff and always will be. I think his idea deserves serious consideration. It would stop illegal immigration permanently. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.